Disclaimer. The views and opinions expressed in this episode are those of the GOAT, or the greatest of all Titos, and do not necessarily reflect the views or positions of all Titos or uncles around the world. Possibly a few, but definitely not all. I've been looking at this thing for around three hours while I was working and I thought to myself why not make an official review so this is my official review of Yellow Bell Health's Taho uh, I don't know if some of you have seen there's this there's this place in the Bang Town Center that was selling uh, Taho and it's not like the traditional taho wherein you see the guy walking around the street every morning. It's not that. Ito medyo, shall I say, kumbaga sa ice cream, yung naglala, naglalako ng taho sa kalye. Para siyang dirty taho. And yung dun sa may town center is medyo refined taho. And... Among the different types of refined taho, that particular um, taho is what I like. UFO taho. Um, that was the brand that was famous, at least in the Alabang area or in the south area. Um, a lot of us liked it. Iba yung take niya. Malamig, their approach was it was cold. Uh, they were selling taho and also uh, soy milk. But of course, nothing beats the uh, original uh, warm taho na nilalako ni Mamang Taho. But anyway, I have come across this brand because of, uh, as I mentioned, you know, I, I, I started a new channel with two of my friends and this was given to us. Uh, to be completely honest, when I tried it then, I wasn't really paying attention. I was more for the content than actually trying it out. So I reached out to Yellow Bell Health and ordered it. So disclaimer, this is not sponsored. This was not given to me. I bought it out of pocket as I always do when I do reviews. I don't accept freebies from, from brands. Um, if ever, which I doubt, if ever I will accept uh, a gift from a brand and they ask me to review it, I will not give them an, an advanced copy of my review. I'm not going to tell them ahead of everyone else. They're going to be just as surprised as I am. So now for the taho, I will officially try it in camera and give you my honest thoughts. So, uh, when you go to their Facebook page or their Instagram account, um, they actually have like an entire product list um, from taho to tofu chips to uh, vegetarian or vegan meats, if I remember correctly. So, just head on over to their Facebook or Instagram page so that you can get their entire product list. This one is 240 milliliters. And this this one one cup is around 55 pesos, not bad for the chilled tau variant. Eh, dun nga sa nga nabibili mo sa mama eh, 20 pesos eh. So this is not bad. Okay, so the order comes with one of these and one of these. Okay. Um, kung kula. We'll see. Uh, according to the according to Yellow Bell, you could actually order. Oh, tamis! You could actually order some more of their Arnibal, and it will go for ten pesos per sachet. Mmm. Oi. 
That's good. Okay. Okay, so ito kagad ah, to be completely honest, ito kagad ang nilamang ng Yellow Bell compared to like in UFO. Uh, the syrup that the UFO was selling back then, it was kind of clear. It was like, this was like the Arnibo type, like this one. Okay, Yellow Bell, may lasa siyang, yeah. Yeah, it tastes like the Arnibal one yung nakakuha mo dun sa local magtatao. So, points to Yellow Bell for the... For being consistent with the with the towel. Okay, so let's mix it together then let's try it on screen. Okay, major firm sha. Take note that this is chilled, okay? This is not maybe I should try it now. Anything cool? No, let's go next time. But right now, this is chilled. Um Okay, I like it. Oy, may sago siya sa ilalim. Wait lang. Let me scoop some to sago. There you go. Okay, it's not like the... Oh no, it's the same sago as yung sa tahu talaga. So, plus points. Let's get that perfect bite. There you go. Ooh. Cheers. Okay. So I would say it kind of tastes cleaner. Siguro because it's processed better, medyo mas mas tapag isipan to compared to like the quote unquote dirty taho. But the overall taste is similar to the, the dirty taho. I like it. Ganun din yung consistency niya, ganun din yung, yung pagka-firm niya ng konti compared to like the taho. Kasi nga yung mga ibang naggagawa na parang, sa would say, gourmet taho. May isa o dalawang essence dun sa totoong taho na nawala eh. Either, the, either it's too firm, parang halos naging tokokwa na siya. Though I know naman na pareho naman siyang tofu, but I mean... Yeah, it's really good. I wonder what it tastes like pag mainit. I'll try it. I'll try another one. Then, we'll it off camera na. Medyo wala na. Ano oras na ba? So, yeah. The consistency is similar to like the regular taho. I am a fan. That's how we normally drink it here. Wala na spoon spoon. Yellow Bell Health Taho. According to Yellow Bell, you can store this in the refrigerator for at least a week. Pero bakit ka naman bibili ng taho tapos di mo naman kakainin ka agad, diba? Di mo order na ulit. Siyempre, the fresher, the better. Again, except for just the, the warmth, of how traditional taho is eaten. This is pretty good. Very close to traditional taho. <laughs> Ayoko na si tawagin dirty taho. But yeah. Oh, very nice. I'll try to warm up uh, when I get my next order. I'll try to warm it up and see if, it will be, if we can get it as close to the original taho or the traditional one. Let you know. I'll let you know on Instagram or in the So that's it. This Tito gives Yellow Bell Health Taho. Two thumbs up. I highly recommend you try the brand. You can easily reach them through Facebook or Instagram. They would reply right away. Um, I don't know kung hanggang saan sila nag deliver But... I know they are like somewhere in the Alabang area and they were able to deliver it in Paranaque. So better check with them or at least get in touch with them to see if they can or you guys can arrange 
having it sent to you via GrabExpress, Lala Move, Move It, or whoever.